Welcome to Vision Academy. In this video, we are going to explore Vivego AI and learn how to use it step by step. We'll see how to generate images from text, how to turn images into videos, and finally how to create videos directly from text. By the end of this tutorial, you'll know exactly how to use Vivego AI for text to image and image to video generation. Before we start, let's take a quick look at one of the videos generated with Vivego AI. As you can see, it creates highly realistic and creative content just from simple prompts. In this tutorial, we are going to learn how to create videos like this one using Vivego AI. Let's begin. Open your web browser and type Vivego AI in the search bar. Click on the official link that appears in the results. Once you're on the homepage, you'll notice the clean and modern interface. On the top right corner, there is a login or register button. Click on it. You can sign in using your Google account, continue with email, or use several other login options provided. To make it simple, I will choose continue with Google. After signing in, the dashboard will open up. Here you'll see three main tools available. Image generator, image to video, and text to video. We are going to check out all of them one by one. Let's begin with the image generator. Click on the image generator button. The interface will load and you'll see a large text prompt box. Here we need to describe what kind of image we want to generate. If you're not sure how to write a good prompt, Vivego AI provides a feature called PromptBot. I will click on PromptBot and type a simple description of what I want. For example, I'll write a man performing mountain biking. Then I click the Submit button. PromptBot will generate a refined prompt for me. Once it generates the prompt, I click on the Use Prompt button to insert it into the text box. Now scroll down a little you'll see the option to upload a reference image. This allows you to generate a new image similar to the one you upload or make modifications to an existing file. If you want to experiment, you can upload any image. But for this demonstration, I will leave it as it is and continue. Scrolling further down, you will see the model selection. Vivego AI currently offers two models, standard and professional. Standard is faster but may be less detailed while Professional generates more realistic and high-quality outputs. I will select Professional to get the best possible results. Next, you can choose the number of images you want to generate. You can create multiple variations at once. For now, I will choose to generate just one image. Then comes the Aspect Ratio selection. There are several options here such as 16,9, 3,2, 4,3, 1,1, 2,1, 3 colon 4, and 9 16. Depending on whether you want landscape, square, or vertical images, you can choose accordingly. I will go with 16 colon 9, which is a common widescreen format perfect for videos. There is also an option to add negative prompts. Negative prompts allow you to specify what you do not want in the image. For example, you might want to avoid blurry results, extra text, or unwanted objects. In this case, I will leave it blank. Once everything is set, click on the Generate button. Now wait for some time while Vivego AI processes your request. This may take a few seconds depending on the complexity. When it's ready, the generated image will appear on your screen. You can see how detailed and creative the result is based on just the simple description we gave earlier. Now let's move on to the next feature, the Image to Video option. Click on the Image to Video button on the dashboard. Here, we can upload the image that we just generated, or you can use any other image from your computer. I will upload the mountain biking image we created earlier. Scroll down and you'll see a prompt box. This is optional, but adding a description helps Vivego AI create more accurate motion in the video. I will click on Prompt Bot again and type climbing bike on the mountains.
After clicking Submit, PromptBot generates a refined version of the prompt. I click Use Prompt to insert it. Now scroll further and select the model. Again, I will choose Professional for better quality. Next, set the duration of the video. Vivego AI lets you create short video clips, so I will keep the duration at 5 seconds. Below that, you'll find a toggle for sound effects. Turn this on if you want your video to come with background audio. I will enable it. You also have the option for negative prompts here, but I will leave it empty. Once everything is ready, click the Generate button. The system will process your request and within a short time, your video will be ready. When the video is generated, preview it to see the result. If you like it, click on the download button to save it directly to your computer. This way, you can start with a static image and bring it to life as a moving video. Now let's try the third option, which is text to video. Click on the text to video button from the dashboard. Here, instead of uploading an image, we will simply type a description of the video we want. To make this easier, I'll use the prompt bot again. This time, I'll type riding the bike on the mountains. Then click submit. Prompt bot will generate a proper AI friendly prompt. I'll click Use Prompt to add it into the text box. Scroll down and set the model to Professional. Then, set the video duration to 5 seconds. Below that, toggle on the sound effects so that the final video comes with audio. Now choose the aspect ratio. The options here are 16.9 for widescreen, 9.16 for vertical videos like Instagram Reels or TikTok, and 1 colon 1 for square videos. I will choose 16 colon 9 again, since it's the best format for YouTube and widescreen viewing. Click Generate and wait for Vivego AI to process the request. After a short while, the video will appear. Preview it, and if you're happy with the result, download it to your computer. So now we have seen all three main tools that Vivego AI offers. First, we created an image using text, then we converted an image into a short video, and finally, we generated a complete video directly from text. As you can see, Vivego AI makes it easy to create high-quality visual content with just a few clicks. Now let's quickly take a look at the videos we generated during this tutorial. Here is the video created from the Image to Video tool. And here is the video created directly from text to video. Both of them look amazing, and it's incredible to see how AI can bring our ideas to life so quickly. This was the complete tutorial on how to use Vivego AI for text-to-image, image-to-video, and text-to-video generation. If you found this tutorial useful, please give it a like and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to Vision Academy for more step-by-step -step tutorials on AI tools and creative technologies. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.